In the previous videos in this series, Project Q and Dispatch Submission Options, we covered creating projects and profiles, entering machine credentials, creating a computer's list, and access methods for collection tasks. In this video, we will continue with creating and then submitting one or more collection tasks. In the Project Manager, highlight a project and click Open. When a project is open, the Project Manager will be empty until tasks are submitted. To start launching job profiles on remote systems, click the Job Queue Manager button to make any settings or credential adjustments on the computer list. In this example, I will be creating collection tasks for different computers on my domain all using the Relay Auto-Deploy method mentioned in the Project Q video. Using the control key to select multiple computers to run, I then click Create Collection Tasks. Once clicked, the tasks will appear in the Collection Tasks grid where they can be reviewed before submission. The user has the option of deleting individual tasks as needed. After reviewing the Collection Tasks list, Click Submit Collection Tasks. The profiles will display in the Job Manager immediately. If the user has access to the Harvester server location from another PC, collection tasks submitted can be tracked from the Project Manager. When tracking a job in the Project Manager, there are different stages it will go through to provide important information on how the job is progressing. Users can stop, restart, resume, or rerun for errors. Color coding displays the stages, and users can customize the colors that represent each stage and status by clicking the Tools tab in the Project Manager and selecting the Grid Colors option. 